Hey, what is up everybody? My name's Star Lord. I hope that you're all having a fantastic day and guys, my prayers have been answered. There's a brand new trap coming to Fortnite Battle Royale for the first time pretty much ever since like, Jesus, like there, there's only ever one trap in this game and that's the spike trap and then obviously but when the game first came out, there was like the electric wall traps and everything like that. But finally, Fortnite are adding brand new traps to the game. And I am very, very hyped to actually reveal them in today's video to all of you guys. It's going to be a pretty awesome one because we actually have a brand new weapon, a brand new trap, and uh, some other kind of information too, which is very, very interesting. So yeah, awesome stuff indeed, guys. Uh, but anyway, before we actually get into today's leak video, guys, please do not forget to leave a like. And also, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already for more videos. Videos just like this one right here daily on this channel um, and also I would like to say uh, as, as as I said it uh, probably in yesterday's video I'm recording these back to back and my voice is gone like I was drinking last night I went out with my friends and stuff while my mother looked after my son and uh, yeah I got very drunk had too much to drink and my throat is absolutely killing so yeah I do apologize about my voice uh, but anyway today guys we're gonna be looking at some brand new leaks for Fortnite Battle Royale and these are all complimentary of a Twitter account by the name of at FNBR leaks. So thank you very much to you guys for actually going inside the in-game files themselves, checking these out and leaking them for all of us to kind of, uh, I guess, go about. Uh, so basically, what you're going to see, the first thing that we're going to be looking at is a new grenade coming to Fortnite and uh, this will be on screen right now. And as you can see, this one was actually rumored a long time ago. This, in fact, is the gas grenade, okay? So basically what it is, is um, it's basically a grenade where when you throw it down, there will be a puff of gas or stink, as Fortnite are calling it, stink grenade. And uh, basically, the longer that you remain inside that gas, the more health it will take away from you. So for example, you know, if you run away from it, you know, you, you'll be okay about it. But if you're inside the gas and uh, you stay there, it'll take away like five damage damage each each couple of seconds you know so it's a very lethal grenade personally i'm not a big fan of this because i feel like things like this really ruin games such as like flamethrowers in call of duty for example i think that damage over time weapons are just not a great idea they're very unfair and uh, yeah i don't like them whatsoever uh, but anyway we actually have proof that this is actually going to be added into the game and uh, that screenshot is going to be on screen right now and as you can see, these are the in-game files themselves. And uh, for those of you who actually know, uh, basically, if you go inside the in-game files, the multiplayer aspect of the files are basically starting with Athena. And uh, this basically means multiplayer, I guess, in Fortnite terms. And uh, as you can see here, we've got a whole load of new assets added into this section right here that say here, poison smoke, um, gas grenade spores, gas grenade outer, gas grenade stacky immunity, uh, gas grenade pulse damage, gas grenades with trajectory, and uh, we've got a lot of stuff basically, and uh, yeah, a lot of this is basically saying, you know, it is going to be poison smoke that is going to be killing you, uh, we are unsure whether it's called the gas grenade or the stink grenade yet, but we do know that around about a week or two ago, all of that wasn't here, and uh, the fact that that's now being added into the game means that Fortnite developers are actually making progress on adding it completely to the game itself. When you see items like this get updated with such a lot of information, like brand new things that say like, you know, with trajectory, pulse damage, stack immunity, you can pretty much bet that yes, those items are coming to Fortnite Battle Royale for the actual multiplayer game. Uh, but basically, somebody actually found that when they actually brought the uh, kind of files into a hex editor, um, it had what you can see on screen right now. And as you can see here, it says, Stink Bomb hurls a grenade that unleashes a cloud of poison. Better clear out. And then it says here, model, uh, question mark, not found. And then it basically says, uh, oh, to the right of that, you know, who leaked, it st uh, leaked the actual stuff out. So, you know, FNBR leaks on Twitter. So again, thank you very much for that, dude. But uh, yeah, they've basically already made uh, the kind of tagline for this. So the thing that we can assume is that, yes, this will become a Fortnite Battle Royale. Probably, actually, probably within the next two weeks. So keep an eye out on that, guys. And if I find out any more information, I will update you guys 
as soon as possible. Uh, but other than that, we're going to be moving on to the brand new ceiling trap that we're going to be having in the game, and uh, this is going to be on screen right now. And as you can see, it is the trap that is actually in uh, the player vs. enemy, or player vs. everything uh, version of Fortnite, which is called Save the World. And uh, this trap's been in it for a long time. Basically, you get different rarities of it. One's a rare, one's an epic, and one's a legendary. And uh, basically what happens is that once somebody is actually underneath it, all of these tires will kind of open up and fall down on that player and kind of crush them. And uh, that's actually what it looks like. It looks like we're going to be getting that in Fortnite Battle Royale. And again, we do have a little bit of a kind of, I guess, a little bit of proof for this. And uh, that's going to be on screen right now. And if you look here, it is again the in-game files for Fortnite. And it says here, Ceiling Electric Single Athena. Um, so wait there, if we just kind of go to it, where does it say it? Where does it say it? Okay, okay, okay. I can't find it. I don't know where it says. Is it Trap Tool? No, it isn't. Where is Ceiling Trap? It should be somewhere. There you go. Okay, is it Ceiling Falling? Yeah, I think it's that, okay? So it looks like, yeah, we will possibly be getting this as an actual trap. I'm sorry that I lost track of where that was then. It's just a lot on screen right now, and it's really, really bright. And I'm kind of hungover, so yeah, I do apologize. Uh, but we also do have a little bit of a tagline for this. Uh, somebody also brought up one of those files in the hex editor, and it says this on screen right now. Ceiling Falling Trap. Drop a series of tires on enemies from up to three tiles high. And now, unfortunately, I don't really know, like, how are you going to drop the things from, like, three like tiles high? I mean, obviously, if you're in, uh, let's say, for example, like, a store um, such as the one in Greasy Grove, you know, the little kind of a uh, sporting goods store, you could probably put it at the entrance and let it drop on people from there. But, uh, again, it just seems a little bit weird to me. And, uh, yeah, very, very interesting indeed. Now, other than that, uh, a couple of people have actually speculated that the reason that the spike trap actually got decreased from 125 damage to 75 basically kind of said... It, it basically kind of shows us that the Fortnite developers may actually be bringing out more spike traps in the game too. So, you know, some spike traps will be uncommon, some can be rare, and then you might even get some that do crazy amounts of damage that could be epic or legendary, you know? So it is very possible that because of these new traps that are getting added into the game, uh, the Fortnite developers may actually start to produce different rarities for some of them, which would be very, very interesting in my opinion. I mean, I would genuinely like it if something like that was added, like, you know, a spike trap that was uncommon, so a green one, and then you could also get a spike trap that was blue that did the original full 125 damage. I would really, really enjoy that. Yeah, I think that'd be really cool. I mean, comment down below. You know, if you guys agree with me, comment down below. I would love to see who would like to see, like, rarity traps added to Fortnite. Uh, but other than that, we do also have one last leak, which I did cover around about four or three days ago now, and that was the bounce pads that are coming back to Fortnite Battle Royale. I'm not really going to talk about them much, but uh, basically, if you guys didn't already know, uh, the bounce pads are coming back, and if you have a shopping trolley and ride over them, it will actually boost your shopping trolley and kind of make you fly a little bit further. It's, it's actually pretty interesting, and uh, I definitely cannot wait till they get added into the game, especially with that brand new game mode, the Playground one. I think that would be very very fun to mess around with like make a huge racetrack or something with just bounce pads everywhere that would be really really cool uh, but anyway guys thank you very much for watching today's video i do appreciate it thank you very very much i would also like to say guys that i have started streaming on facebook i know it's a bit of a weird platform to stream on but uh, I've got a really good thing going on over there, and uh, I do daily giveaways of money on the stream. So basically, I give away around about £8 or about $10 so that you guys can actually go and buy skins for yourselves in Fortnite Battle Royale. If that sounds like something that you guys would be interested in, please go into the description of today's video. Click on that link that says Facebook. Uh, but anyway, other than that, guys, I would like to say thank you very much for watching today's video. Nathan was just shouting, so I did have to cut that little part out. Uh, but anyway, like I said, go and follow that Facebook page, guys. And the best of luck to all of you guys who tune into my live streams. And uh, yeah, hopefully you can win some money. Uh, but anyway, guys, thank you very much for watching. Have an awesome day. And until next time, I've been Star Lord. Oh, so.